What's that your grandfather used to do? That story about the mailman? Oh, good gosh. I don't tell that. He came to me with the paper, and he named somebody that we all knew, the postmaster in the little town, you know, Cold Camp. Everybody knew Oscar Connor because that's the postmaster. And uh, he said, well, I see some news from home this morning. Oh, uh, yeah, I don't know. I must have been nine years old. Oscar Connor was indicted, and they think he's going to get five years in prison. What did he do, Grandpa? He was whitewashing rat manure and selling it for rice. <laughs> you know, all that stuff. Well, sure, me as little crippled up grandson there, he made us all laugh. What's it like having a tattoo artist next door? I wish I had two of them like Stoney. Good neighbor, good businessman, a heck of a good fella. One of the best. Is this your first tattoo? Yeah. He was with his buddy. Uh, little Stuck, little. I think I'm going to get more, though, later on. Oh, you are. I'm putting comeback in it. <laughs> I, I drop a little two drops of it in there, you know, come back. Yeah. Dan's going to get another one. Oh, Stoney's not crazy. Must be something to him, all them old coon dog and all of them. <laughs> Keep coming back and sending me people, everything. Cousineau, all of them. That's a lot of football players, Tony? Yes, yes. These guys can tell you, they see them on them, don't they? We're all crazy. <laughs> <laughs> no, you're not crazy. <laughs> Weightlifters, football players, and wrestlers. wrestlers That's yeah. what I get. That's good. That's good. <laughs> Did somebody send you to me? No, I'm just uh, cruising up the avenue. You haven't here. heard of me? No, sir. Oh, Ray Jarman. Well, known all over the world. So have faith in me.